Hey guys, this is SpyKid197 here teaching you how to make a World of Warcraft private server. Uh, for this tutorial, we'll be using the Jolt V Pack uh, V12, which I have right here. Okay, so what we're going to want to do is go to um, this link here, it'll be in the description. So, go to that. Password is O O F L, all lowercase. And then you just download it. Okay, so then you should be in um, this window, the Jolt Repack. I'm just going to make the window fit perfectly. Okay, so what you're going to want to do is you're going to open MySQL, Alchemy, Logon Server, and World, which I already have all open here. MySQL, Logon Server, and world. So then it should all load up after about 30 seconds ish. And then you're going to go into your World of Warcraft um, directory and data ENUS realm list. That's my IP that I use. You will be using 127.co.0.1 and then you would save it. But since mine's public, I can use that other one as well. Um, I'm not going to teach you how to make it public right now because it takes a while to figure it out. But if you want to change some things, like um, say you want to change. Uh, your starting level. Right, so you're going to go into world. Um. Um. Well, here's the experience rate. Uh, reputation, uh, PvP timer, uh, experience rate, it's a little high. Best experience rate, quest experience, explore experience, all this stuff. It's like in um, world, but Yeah, that's not it. So you're gonna go into, I think it's a logon server. No, optional. That's what it is. All of your kind of realm thingies are gonna be an optional level cap, starting level. So we want the starting level. If you put level cap 300, it'll only cap up to 80 automatically then you can just do um, a quest or something to level up all the way um, just change these two to the exact same thing Burning Crusade Starting Talents for Death Knights the only thing this repack doesn't have I find is um, talents they don't exactly work so um, you can use another repack but um yeah so um that's how you configure things I'm gonna change my cap limit to 350 okay so um 
that's pretty much it for uh, configuring that kind of stuff. So in the next tutorial, I'll probably be teaching you how to make it public. Bye.